we talked about this already. The, these solutions, there is a platform for managing work um, and organized work, projectized work um, on the Microsoft platform. And that's what they're building. That They're not building one tool that does everything. They're not, they're not, they used to, they used to have project and project server and, you know, project online is like, that's the tool you use. That's the, all you need to manage your projects. And there's been a shift. Um, Microsoft is, is enabling these solutions that are built on the entire platform. Um, and they're, they're positioning the platform to be able to build out these solutions specific to the way that your company wants to use them. Um, and so it's everything. It's um, everything from the use of Power BI uh, for reporting. Um, of course, you know, Microsoft is not going to have its own a separate reporting solution just for project management. They're going to leverage the enterprise grade, um, very highly successful Power BI. Um, they're not going to have another solution that handles workflow inside of a project management system. They're going to leverage Power Automate, which is, an, again, a very robust enterprise grade solution. And Power Apps um, is what Microsoft Project is now built on and with. So Project for the web that we just showed and that George talked about is itself a Power App. Um, it is built entirely um, on the Power Platform. So when we talk about the Power Platform, we're, we're, we're usually talking about these three things today. Um, there's, there's also Power Virtual Agents, which we won't get into a lot today, but we are starting to dip our toe into as well. Um, so Power BI for reporting, Power Automate for workflow, um, and automation, and Power Apps to create these centralized experiences um, in, in the Microsoft Platform. Mm -hmm.